Okay, so one of the questions I'm seeing a lot is how to turn a document that you've got in Word, uh, any form of docx or doc file, into a PDF. One of the common things I see um, with clients is that they'll download tons of different applications for free PDF conversion. Um, many and most of these applications or programs um, are free and they're free because they sacrifice your personal security and information um, in, in exchange for that, uh, that free price tag. What that means is you'll download any of these thousands of conversion apps that are available across the internet to convert a document to a PDF. Um, and in doing so, you're installing malware on your computer that will then phone home to their servers and exchange information about your computer and how you use it and things like that to sell to advertisers. Um, you do not have to do that. You do not need any extraneous applications, um, any outside software to do a conversion into a PDF. It's actually built directly into Microsoft Word. So I've pulled up a document here. I created a document in Word, and you'll see here I've just got this information um, just from <clears throat> one of my Windows Insider emails. And I want to make this into a PDF. Now, one of the things to uh, highlight here is the primary difference between a PDF and a Word document is a Word document is just that, is a document. So it's made to be edited, altered, changed, um, whatever you want to call it. Uh, whereas a PDF is a portable document format, and the PDF is designed specifically to create two things. One, a unified format for all computers to be able to use, whether it's Mac or Windows or Linux, a file type that can be read by all computers, and it is a locked file type. And what that means is you can send that document out. It, it's perfect for printing. It's perfect for display on a computer, but it's not editable without external software. So it's just a flat document ready to be viewed um, or passed on or shared or whatever else um, that doesn't have any native inability to be altered or changed. Okay. So we're going to go into Word here, uh, and we're going to work on this one as an example. I have this document, and all we're going to do is go over to File, okay? And you'll see that there's an option here for Export. When you click on that, the options are to create a PDF for XPS document or to change the file type. We want to create a PDF. So we'll simply click on that. We will select where we want the do document to save, and we'll just name this... Um, uh, Windows, oops, 11 Android. And then you'll notice that it's automatically identified as a PDF extension, and we're just going to click publish. It takes only a mo couple seconds for it to complete, and it automatically opens that document when it's finished to show you that it has been converted into a document format. And you'll see that the PDF has now been created. Now I can go ahead and minimize and get out of everything here and we can go over to where I save this on the desktop here, this document, and open it again just so you can see that we've now created a PDF out of that document. So no external applications needed. Uh, you don't have to install any additional software that puts you at risk, anything like that. Um, uh, as I mentioned, one thing that we see commonly on customers' computers is we will come in and we will see that they have anywhere between 1 and 12 or 13 extensions, different types, uh, that they downloaded and installed for the express purpose of turning a document into a PDF. Um, and that's not necessary. It just bugs your computer down, obviously exposes it security-wise. Um, it's just totally unnecessary when you can do it directly from inside Word. So I hope that video helps. Let me know if you have any questions.